Hi everybody, it's Wednesday which means it's our second book for the week of our Anthony Brown series. Hope you're enjoying, if you are let me know in the comments, make sure that you subscribe to the page and like us on Facebook that you'll find in the description below. But without further ado, let's read Willie's Pictures by Anthony Brown. Willie likes painting and looking at pictures. He knows that every picture tells a story. The birthday suit. Quick, cover yourself up. My best ever sandcastle. I was so pleased with it, but I had an odd feeling that the castle was trying to warn me of something. Lots and lots and lots of dots. We gradually started to notice some very strange things in the park. The kind woman. I have been getting a bit bored with painting all that grass. Early morning dream. I'm just taking my dog for a walk. My birthday. At first I thought it was great fun, but would they ever stop? At the swimming pool. Oh no, it's the wrong changing room. Coming to life. I was just finishing this painting when I heard a small voice say, Give us a hand. The mysterious smile. Can you solve the mystery? The fruitful fishing trip. We hadn't caught anything all day. We were on our way home when we cast our line for the last time. Room without a view. I had always hated looking out of that window. So one morning I decided to do something about it. My nightmare. The dreadful invitation read, You are cordially invited to attend the wedding ceremony of Millie and Buster Nose. An odd day. As soon as we got there, it seemed that Millie was in a hurry to go home. I'm sorry, she said. I must fly. And she was off. Landscape with onion. We followed it for miles before we finally hunted it down. Nearly a self-portrait. Some of my friends wanted to help. The hero. I can dream, can't I? Now, open the folded out pages to see the pictures that inspired Willie. Those pictures tell stories too. Try matching them with Willie's pictures and read what Willie thinks and says about them. The end. And then you've got some lovely pages that fold out that tell you of the original paintings, so the original artists and a bit of a story behind why they were painted. So what I was going to do is I'm going to take some pictures and I'll pop them up on my Facebook page, which you find in the description below. And maybe you can have a look at the pictures that Willie painted and the originals and try and see if you can connect and see some similarities and some differences. So things are the same, things that are different. Wow, what a wonderful story and very interesting pictures that Willie painted for us to look at. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you again on Friday. See you later. Bye.